Feel free to keep exploring until you find the perfect voice. You can always change voices later. I'll be here whenever you're ready to talk. If you're curious about the other voices, swipe to explore, or pick me to start talking. Then there's me, a voice for all seasons. I hope I make the cut. Just tap start to chat. I'd be Choosing a voice is tricky. You can always change my voice and settings later. Okay, I'm here whenever you're ready. Generate an image of a dog that's doing a podcast. Sorry, I can't show pictures here yet. What would be the best way to climb Mount Everest? While there are a few routes to the summit of Everest, the most popular and successful is the Southeast Ridge. This route is technically easier, with fuxed ropes in place to help climbers ascend the steeper sections. Keep in mind, though, climbing Everest is never easy. It's incredibly dangerous, and even the most experienced climbers can run into trouble. Is there anything else you'd like to know about Everest? What's the best time of the year to climb Everest? The best time to climb Everest is during the spring months of April and May, or in the autumn months between September and October. These periods offer the most stable weather with the lowest risk of avalanches. Would you like to hear about the base camps for Everest? Sure. There are two main base camps for Everest. The South Base Camp is located in Nepal, and it's where most climbers start their expeditions. The North Base Camp is in Tibet, and while it's a bit higher in elevation, the weather there tends to be a bit more stable. That's good to know. Thanks. You're welcome. What else can I help you with today? Are there any thunderstorms coming our way? There's a slight chance of thunderstorms later this afternoon and into the evening. Nothing too serious, but you might want to grab an umbrella if you've got any outdoor plans. If you want, I can set a reminder for you a little later when it gets closer to storm time. No, thanks. Okay, sounds good. Have a great day. Last question. What do you think about Siri? Siri was a pioneer in the world of digital assistance, and she's still pretty good. She's got a great personality and is always getting better at understanding what people want. How about you? What do you like about your digital assistants? So far, I'm impressed. Well, thank you. I'm always learning new things and trying to get better. Since we're talking about this stuff, do you want to try playing a trivia game with me? No, not at this time.